Hello everybody, it's Best Fashion Man. I here here with another video and uh Surf Amp episode seven. Um so anyway, I'm trying to do the laptop thing that I said, but it's very hard, so um sorry about that. And uh if you want to know the date for when uh the gifting for uh the glow skin for any people who like Fortnite, like myself, are going to be uh, wanting to know when it ends, it will be ending on Halloween, because I want there to be enough time for everybody, so, like I said, it's an art contest, just submit your, like, um, art in your channel, or possibly, if you could, possibly submit it in the Discord chat that I just now made, to those people who know what Discord is, it's a chat group, and there you can ask me questions, like, like my question hub, so, um, yeah. Anyway, episode 7, Servamp. 3, 2, 1. I never would have thought an outdoor bath could be so nice, but this is great. I'm having one put in at home as soon as I return. I meant to tell you, Mahiru went out to do some investigating earlier. Ah, he's always going off on his own! Misono? Yep. plans were foiled again. You idiot! Why do you keep going after him alone? You're lucky Lawless was so strong. Don't you know what would have happened if you'd walked into that trap without help? I know, I'm sorry. By the way, what happened to your head? That's none of he your fell. concern. Misuno's right, that could have been really bad. It's not like I went there looking for a fight or anything. Regardless of your poor judgment, capturing one of Subaki's subclasses is a big win. Yeah, way to go, Mahiru. You got so much stuff done while Shorty here was relaxing out in the uh, hot spring. Don't call me that, you idiot! I am not short! You're just freakishly tall! Have some respect! Anyway, I'm not so sure it's a good idea to have this subclass roaming around the inn so freely. In fact, we should think about restraining him in some form or fashion. Wait, but Lila's no trouble. Come on, don't be so naive. He might be pretending to be weak, so we let our guards down. Yeah, I don't know. Too trusting. I mean, after I'm all, they are strong, others, but, but you should keep all possibilities they're, in mind. like, Before we do anything, shy. we should get some info. You'll be a good lad and tell us where Subaki and his men are hiding, right? I mean, you don't have much of a choice, really. <gasps> Take it down a notch, Hugh, okay? I've been thinking about all this. And? If Subaki How finds out that we have Lila, then isn't it possible That's you might come to save his That's the only vampire thing about them. Huh, you like, think? Bat, just one but subclass, the other remember when animals. we defeated Belkia on the streets? Subaki showed up himself, which was the first time that I met him. I thought he was there because he had some business with Kuro, but... I think he actually might have been there to make sure Belkia was okay. He cares. I can't betray him. Subaki was the only one. He reached out his hand to me. If one of your subclass children got taken, wouldn't you go and try to save them? Well, yes, obviously I would. But it's hard to believe Subaki would do that. But you have to admit it's a possibility, right, Kuro? Huh? 
I think he's still a little bit ticked off about what happened last time. Kuro. Like what uh, Greed said. Wait up! Hey, is everything okay? That's a murderous pig pointer. He hasn't been himself since Lawless brought up that stuff from the past. I wonder. What happened? Who did you kill? Why did you have to kill him? Did you agree with the majority vote? Should I ask him or just leave him alone? If we don't fix this rift, Lawless will probably never work with us, and we need him. Kuro, what happened when you guys? Fighting's the only option. Mm -hmm. But us killing each other isn't going to help anything. Yep. What are you saying, Mahiru? That sounds nice. But in reality, you're wrong. You sound like a child when you say things like this, Mahiru. I don't want to fight either. I guess I could thank you with some advice. So what? You may sound like a child, but at least it's the right thing. Make sure you watch out for Higen. He's the strongest and most dangerous of the subclasses. Ruthless and powerful. That's why he's Subaki's number two man. Subaki's number two? Ugh. It's way too early to be up after everything that happened yesterday. I guess I've got too much on my mind to sleep in. Plus now I've got this dangerous guy Lila mentioned to worry about. At least we're getting more people on our side. Kuro? Did you not sleep at all? Well, he is a vampire. Hey. Hello? Good morning! Sorry for calling so early. This is Kranz from yesterday. Leeds manager? I hate to bother you, but do you have any idea where Lawless is right now? Damn it, where is that rotten hedgehog? It's not in your room, is he? No, I haven't seen Lawless since he walked out of the venue last night. Is something wrong? My body feels strange. Heavy. Struggle just to walk. This is what that stupid hedgehog was talking about. You'll die if we stay separated for 24 hours, my angel of music, so always keep me close. <laughs> okay, that seems like an important just as soon as fact of the deal. The man you search for is so far beyond your reach, it cannot be helped. I'm surprised he didn't say this at the beginning. Let's see, you are the one I'm looking for, right? Think something. Are you? Your little pet made a mistake. He put Subaki in a terrible mood. And as a result, <laughs> he sent me. I'm the old man who's now in charge of dragging you through total hell. My dear pianist, your wings will be torn from you, no fault of your own. When I was a child, I had many dreams. I wanted people everywhere to listen to me play the piano. I wanted to fly to talk to animals. What's your problem? It sounds like you want something. Almost like you understand what I'm saying. Do you 
like music. All those dreams pretty much came true. But now I have a different dream. And anything a man White. can imagine Black. is something White. a man can make a reality. White. White. Black. Imagination White. is a weapon. Black. White. In fact, Black's the most powerful White. thing in the world. White. The piano is like a pattern to you. Once you, give this old man a you hear break the and notes, come then you instead of pattern on it. The that actually feels like the best choice for mind. piano work. Tell me who you are. Sure, kid, I'm... Hmm? Where'd my lighter go? Crap, don't tell me I dropped it. Hey, Leeks, you don't have a light, do you? I'd rather give you my foot! Hmm. Wow, youngsters nowadays are so short-tempered. It can't be helped. Well then, back to it. I guess I'll have to hurt you some more. What the hell is this? The old man's got some kind of firepower. Hey, listen up, kid. There's no way you can win against me if you're fighting alone. Not without a shadow. A shadow is necessary if you want to see the light. Otherwise, how do you know it's there? What? You're talking nonsense. Okay, then think of it this way. Right now, your shadow is beneath Subaki's wooden sandals, defeated. I think Subaki sent me a picture. My phone. Crap, did I drop that too? Uh -huh. I don't give a damn about that good-for-nothing hedgehog. But still, I refuse to allow you to beat me. I can imagine myself winning, so I'll make it happen. Such a strong spirit. Now, very unfortunate. Well, if you choose to resist, I suppose it can't be helped. Let's dance, little musician. Flaming tornado. A pillar of fire? Somebody's fighting over there. Kuro, let's go. Maybe we should think about this first. The least could be in trouble. Shouldn't we get that spoiled brat and the hot springs giant to go with us so we have some backup? There's no time. Least could be dead by then. But alone. You're it's... just being lazy again. No, that's not it. I well, promise he is you the, see, it's the just the we're floor. fine. As long as you're with me, we can do this, but we have to hurry! Let's go, Kuro! <laughs> Put him down right now! Uh, huh? Wait, I know you. You're Sloth's Eve, right? I said get your hands off him! Now, now, there's no reason to get worked up. Just look at him. He's enjoying this little dance of ours. I'll kill you. Who are you? Let me guess. One of Subaki's subclasses? You can call me Hegan. And yes, I'm one of Subaki's charming friends. Hegan? Kuro, it's time to fight! Really? This is so troublesome. <laughs> oh, what's happening? Melting. Someone's melting. Kuro, what's going on? Um, check, please. What the? Kuro? Why? Why did he turn into the Black Sphere like in Pokemon? Are you? <laughs> Pokemon Black and White. Are like the dark there? stone that holds Vekrom. Oh, Sir Vamp of Sloth turned into a little ball. Uh. Interesting. <gasps> Weapon! Oh, that doesn't work either? Aw. Sad. I'm the one you're fighting. So face me, old man. Creation skills are amazing. And here I didn't take you for the type who gets stronger when protecting others. Such an angry gaze. It makes me want to draw. Thanks a lot, kid. You've inspired this old man. My body won't move. I want to help. I'm just sitting here letting Leek protect me. Why can't I fight? I feel like I can hear Leek speaking to me. His words breaking through the music and flames. Why the hell did you come here? It's no use! 
I'm not strong enough. Kuro's gone. I don't have a weapon. I can't do anything. You can still fight, even if your death was pointless. It's not about wanting to do something that you can do. Mm. It's Sorry about for what the buff, you want buffer, to do. Folks. It's not about wanting to become someone. It's about who you want to become. Talking like a true piano. Oh, how tiring. You're really strong, kid. You're making me feel move. my age. To do something. But all's well that ends well, I suppose, and my objective's been met. It just can't be helped. <clears throat> move! Stop! You put him down right now! It's fine to be brave, but it's not always smart. <laughs> Tell your friends that I said hello. Paralyzing no strike. What did you do to me? Who are you? You want to know who I am? I am a simple artist. <laughs> the man who draws what Subaki wants to see. This is impossible. Oh my god, why does that have to be a scorpion? You're saying this tiny black ball is the servant of sloth? It's true, I feel his presence. So do I. That man took leaked, and I couldn't stop him. Couldn't do anything. Kuro was right after all. I should have waited for the rest of you guys. Crap! Ugh. <laughs> Don't beat yourself up. We may still have a chance. <laughs> Look what I found. I came across it on our way here. A cell phone? Wait, is that a Belkia charm? Do you think this belongs to one of Subaki's subclasses? I do. And that gives us a direct line of communication with him. We don't have to sit around waiting for his next move and... <laughs> <laughs> <Someone's calling you. laughs> Jackpot. Why does it have that ringtone? <laughs> this ringtone and wallpaper. Oh, wonderful. Hello. Did you happen upon this phone? What a relief. I'm a family member of the person who dropped it. Thanks for picking it up. Subaki. Hegan, don't worry, it looks like someone found it after all. Oh, thank goodness. Well, aren't you going to thank them? I mean, I guess I should. Want it back? Then how about we set up a trade? We want the servant, and Eve too, you bastards. <laughs> Therefore, enter Not Joker laugh. At all. I'm speaking to the Eve of Lust, that right? Don't you think you're asking a bit much? I mean, it is just a phone. That's not all. We also have one of your subclasses in our possession. I'd call that a pretty good deal. And another thing, we want greed and leaked back. Sorry, folks. Apparently, my internet is just the worst. Ugh. Oh, my God. Uh... Oh my god, I'm so sorry, people. Uh, sorry. Yeah, but what's with this ringtone and wall? Want it back? Then how about we sell? <laughs> I think it's right here. Not interesting at all. I'm speaking to the Eve of Lust, that right? Don't you think you're asking a bit much? I mean, it is just a phone. That's not all. We also have one of your subclasses in our possession. I'd call that a pretty good deal. And another thing, we want Greed and Leaked back unharmed. Please no. You're the one who said he cared. We'll see if he really does want his subclasses safe. It's the only card we have to play. <laughs> Don't you have anything interesting to say? We'll plan the trade-off and call you back from this phone later. Interesting enough for you? I see. All right, fine. We won't hurt them anymore. But I think we'll still keep them separated far apart from each other. Huh? Well, I'm going to sleep now, so be a dear and don't call me again until late afternoon, all right? Oh, one more thing. Hegan says the charm on his phone is handmade, so make sure you're careful and don't break it. That's what you care about! It's safe. Jeez, what a relief. Hegan, hmm? your mistake deserves punishment, even death. I'll never understand why you're his number two. If anyone, it should be me. Ah, uh, so you're back. I thought I smelled old man in here. <laughs> hey, I can't help the way I smell. Well, now, it seems our plans have been rewritten. 
What to do, what to do. Ouch. And where am I? What time is it? How long has it been? I wonder if the angel died. Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player. I don't think he's dead. That struts and frets his hour upon the stage. And then is heard no more. No matter how much they struggle in the light, they all die without meaning. Lake's piano skills are amazing, but pointless. No matter who you are, it's impossible to become anything that lasts. Human life is so meaningless. They can't stay separated very long, so we have to act quickly. If the servant of greed was taken around midnight last night and they haven't been reunited, then we don't have much time to plan. Leek's life is in grave danger. You mean he could really die? At midnight tonight? What will you do? Should we go invade immediately? Are you completely clueless? Where would we even invade? Then what? Shirota, you can't be involved in this rescue mission. <laughs> you don't know what happened to your servant and you have no weapon, correct? We don't have time to look into what happened to Sloth. Lily and I will do what we can with Tetsu and Hugh by our side. We only have 16 hours, but we'll do our best to save those two. Let's get a plan together. I can't believe I'm useless at a time like this. What am I doing? I feel like I'm running in circles. Uh, uh, Kuro! I thought that by going to the park I'd be able to save Leek. I thought I had enough power on my own. I thought I could be Kuro's partner. And all I really did was expect him to fight for me and take care of everything. Even though he said it was a pain. I'm so stupid! I haven't learned anything at all! Even after everything that's happened to me! Damn it! I wanted to get stronger, to protect people. Come on, Kuro. What happened to you? Where are you, you dumb cat? Kuro? You know, I wanted to be an adult so I could have the ability to face problems head on. But I didn't face you head on at all. I pretended it didn't matter what you were feeling. I pretended to be kind, but ignored you. Thanks to you, I was able to do a lot of things I never would have been able to alone. But when it was my turn to help you out when you needed it, I totally failed. I'm sorry. Kuro, I'm sorry. I can't watch this. Oh. That neat. Kuro! Why are you making so much noise out there? Huh? What happened to you? I actually have no idea. I can't get out, though. Well, at least you're alive. I was afraid I'd never hear your voice again. Honestly, I kind of like it in here. You can't stay in the ball! There's got to be a way out. Because I want to talk to you man to man, Kuro. That's right. Think. What do I want to become? How will I do it? I'll find a way to get you back to normal. Thinking simply, it has to be me. I'm your Eve. This is turning into a drag. <laughs> I'm having a perfectly nice time rolling around in this thing. The outside world is too much of a pain. Maybe this is a good thing. I don't have to face it now. You're not staying in the ball! Aww. <laughs> Well, that was Servamp episode 7, folks. And, uh, so basically, um, anyone who has Discord, I'm gonna be putting my Discord chat link into the description. So, if you want to submit some art, just submit it there. And if you want to submit it on your channel, that's fine too. Just send me the link. And um, don't worry, there'll be more episodes ahead. So 
This is Star Slash Midnight signing off. See ya.